Ready, ready? ready, ready. You sure you're ready? All right. All right, this is the part. Actually on camera here. Ready? Petey. Ugh, screwed up. No script, I don't care. Wounded, wounded. I'm already speakers. screwing it up. A special appearance by First Lady Michelle Obama. Welcome to this year's this. Syphilis. Gonorrhea. Gone. All right, we recording? I'll just do the last one. I'm uh, Chris Piles, and I'm here to talk to you about electronic news yeah, gathering. I forgot what I was saying. Now, I chose to do my video on these because it's what I actually do. I'm a field reporter for the United States Air Force, and I go around and I do ENG, electronic news gathering. And electronic news gathering is really just, it's a single camera operation, usually consisting of small crews that pretty much do short news stories. We gather all of our footage throughout the days. We maybe do interviews, stand-ups, things like that, and then we compile it into a story. And it's usually very short. It's not long form. Uh, I usually try and stick to around four minutes at most. That way I can guarantee that I get airtime on our station. And then we just you know send that back home so that our producers can plug it into a larger show because we have a half hour show we have a five minute show and then we have a two minute show and then we have uh just the single reports that we put out on the web and things like that so what i do mainly is i go out to different locations like i just got back yesterday from the warrior games in colorado springs at the air force academy where a lot of our disabled and uh injured veterans and even active duty guys were out there competing and it was kind of cool because michelle obama came out and opened up the ceremony so um throughout the week what i was doing was i was producing one story a day staff sergeant chris piles is there and brings us this look at the action every day i would produce a new story and it would get shot back and then the next day they would air it and talk about what happened the previous day and how many medals we won what what kind of events took place things like that and it was it was really cool to see all the stuff that was going on and that's one of the fun parts of the job is you're constantly meeting new people um. <laughs> You're constantly in a new location. You are you're constantly uh, trying to get controlled shots out of an uncontrolled environment, and that's half the challenge. Then, and a lot of it is the the lack of control is it's an intimidating factor for some people because you can't control your natural environment, the the noises, things like that. Uh, just the way people are and you have to just kind of gauge what people are gonna do and react to it or try and you know, be proactive to that and work around it and work with it. And that's one of the cool things. So out of all the jobs from our week one reading, I chose ENG, not only just because I am an ENG reporter, it's because I really do enjoy it the most. And it's kind of a jack of all trades. Uh, I'm usually a one-man band when I go out on a job. I, I shoot, I write, I narrate, I edit, I you know package it all together, I send it back to the station, and uh, you know they usually like what I do. So <laughs> I haven't heard too many complaints yet, but uh, that that's really uh, why I chose it. I mean, I love my job, and I hope you enjoyed hearing about it. So thanks for listening.